we have byte addressability on RAM. You can definitely write single byte in RAM. Definitely, that's fine, right? But on disk, uh, persistent, no, you gotta write in pages, right? And that's what, what we have today. And because of that cost, right? Writing to whole data files, what the data storage engine does, like as you change, all these changes goes to RAM. Bop, 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 bop. We call them dirty pages. The moment you touch a page where ha you have a raw or collection or document, we just mark it as dirty. And again, the storage engine doesn't know it's a document. It just knows it's bytes. It knows it's a page with a bunch of bytes that you touched, right? And then you write in memory, and so it's fast. And then later, the storage engine will collect as much changes as possible and then flush it once right? to the database. All of this is the job of the storage engine. Right? I still didn't come to the difference between SQL and NoSQL, but you, you, we're going to get there. Right? You're clearly going to see it. I think by, the, by this time, if you're still watching or listening, you're probably going to know the difference. Right? So we're not writing immediately right we're collecting this change you might say hussein but, but wait a minute you're writing to ram if i commit you're writing to ram what if i crash that's the problem right so that's why in case to to recover from the crash we create this called something the thing that's called wall the write ahead log so as we write to the ram to these da data pages we also write on disk tiny things that says hey here's a journal on this date i on this date right dear diary on this date i updated the salary from 10000 to 10050 cent uh, it's a bad year what do you want me to say right 